Hi. Right. Today we will talk how to find the parts in the schematic diagram. As you see, this is a schematic diagram for uh, for the laptop models REV A00. So now, if we want to find any parts in this schematic diagram or anyone if uh, you want to find any integrated circuit or any transistor any piece maybe it's difficult to find from all this this above it about uh, more than 100 page so how we can find the parts easily and fast Okay, for example, we want to find <coughs> the DC jack. DC, we write here DC in. As you see here. This is the DC in. This is charging port. Here. Now we go to picture of uh, this uh, laptop, and we will try to find some parts from this motherboard. For example, this is. This transistor is PU4003. I want to find it in schematic diagram. 4003. I press enter. Now, as you see, this is the 4003. This one. This one four zero zero three. This is MOSFET AO four four zero seven AL. This is the part number of this MOSFET. And which circuit this I can find when I go the hair down. This is this MOSFET in charging circuit battery charging circuit okay now we'll try to find another one for example this IC this IC is numbers starting with U2901 I go to schematic diagram U2901 I press enter as you see this is the integrated circuit in the schematic diagram now I want to know what what is the use of this integrated circuit I check here this page As you see, this page belongs to audio codec. So, this IC belongs to the sound circuit 2901. From this IC here, schematic diagram, I can see the voltage input, input voltage, output voltage, signal coming from all the spin. I can check also.
as you see schematic diagram is helping us to find the problem as you see from this pin going to the speaker left plus left minus audio and this from this line going to a uh, right speaker minus and a plus this being going to amplifier and mute sound the mute now we check for another IC this IC number is U2701 we go to U2701 and enter as you see this is the IC U2701 okay I want to know what's what is the classification or specification for this IC or what uh, what this IC what the use of this IC I can't check here KBC no but this is KBC this IC is belong to IO circuit input output voltage circuit input output circuit this is very important IC because if this IC is stopped the laptop will be stopped not working this is what they call IO input output now we try another one for example this transistor or maybe uh, this one 4000 PU 4004 PU 4004 As you see this IC This is not IC this is a MOSFET the part number is AO4496 so we want to know which circuit this this is charging circuit and this IC is charging IC as you see here charger PQ24 704 this is the IC charging or uh, char charging IC if I want to know what is the sophistication of this of this MOSFET AO4496 I go to this website all data sheet and uh, I write here to search for the smart data sheet And, and you, as you see, this is AO4496. This is N channel enhanced mode field effect transistor. 
Er the general description, description. The AO446 uses advanced train technology to provide excellent RDS with low gate charger. This device is suitable for use as DC to DC converter, etc. etc. The important thing here: the voltage of this IC, the current high voltage, is 30 volt. And the ampere, high ampere for this one is 10 amperes. And here, this is schematic diagram, and this is the block diagram. Now, I want to know what is this IC U6001. U six double zero one enter. No, sorry, here. U six double zero one. This is flash memory. Part number is W two five Q three two thirty two. PVSS. This is the BIOS chip. This is including the BIOS file in this IC. Flash memory IC. This IC SPI flash memory is very important. If the, the file is damaged, laptop will not work. Will not work. Okay. They search for another. This IC is U3101. U3101. Enter. Now, this IC is in LAN circuit. This is LAN chip. This is LAN chip. So below, if I have any problem in LAN circuit, I must check this IC and the parts belong to this IC, this circuit. As you see, as I told you before, for example, this is LAN circuit. Every piece, every part from this circuit start with 3000 something for example this resistor r3117 this capacitor c3114 this coil l3101 so all this parts starting with 3000 is belong to lan chip Okay. Now I will check this. I see. This U three two zero one. U three two zero one. This IC card belong to card reader. As you see, card reader. This IC. If I want to know any I have any problem with card reader, so I check this IC and the other part belong to this IC.
now this IC PU4201 I go to schematic diagram I write here 4201 and enter is showing here this IC I want to know what is the use of this IC this IC is CPU cover CU core this IC is now if I, if I want to know more about this IC what I do what is the number of this IC ISL three eight three one. I go to data sheet. I download data sheet of this IC. I must check what is the voltage input output voltage in order to know here this is uh, this IC is used CPU regulator so this IC is working as CPU regulator this is uh, this IC supply processor by voltage regulated voltage as you know processor must get very very regulated voltage very clear and very uh, something is must be correct hundred percent in order to work for the CPU so here is sorry not this one <coughs> Now, as you see, as I said, you can check it uh, later. As I said, this IC is CPU regulator. Thank you for watching. If you have any question, you can comment in the description. Try to understand schematic diagram and try to work hard. If you if you know how to read schematic diagram, you will find a way to be experienced and you to be professional. Cause schematic diagram will help you to repair any kind of any electronics not only laptop laptop desktop uh, lcd led tv any any parts if you have schematic diagram you can repair this device thank you
for watching my channel if you like please uh, subscribe subscribe to my channel and uh, like and comment thank you for you